Governor Nasai Rufai of Kaduna State may have further fanned the flames of division in Kaduna State by dismissing the concerns of Southern Kaduna leaders and tagging them criminals. He made these comments in an interview on China's television on Sunday night. The governor alleged that Southern Kaduna leaders were lying about the situation of things in the long-running crisis between their people and the Fulani. Governor Erufai said they were concealing the culpability of their people in the crisis so as to garner sympathy from outsiders and secure financial support as well. He said unlike his predecessors, he would not appease them but would ensure they were arrested and duly prosecuted for prolonging the crisis. <laughs> well, this is uh, what he said on tennis television. Of course, it's a national TV that anybody can go there and confirm. And uh, one thing is that I was thinking that, oh, maybe some people are just trying to make uh, something out of nothing, you know, trying to extract what he has said or try to, is it to downplay? Not downplay try to uh, take what he has said out of context but it's been confirmed that he's, he said it on the national television and one thing is that he said he's not going to appeal to them he's not going to appeal to them he's not going to appease them that they will be dealt with they will get they will get arrested they will get they, don't, they will get arrested but one thing is that the problem we are having with all these uh, people so called leaders is that you know at the federal level they will blame this, they will blame that, they will blame the other person, they will blame everybody. They will say, oh, these are the people causing problems. Then you cannot go after them. The federal government will tell you it is the opposition. Oh, another day they will tell you, oh, it is the people in that area that are supporting those who are committing uh, all manner of crimes. And you cannot go after them. You will get information, you will not do anything. You begin to apportion blames. And you have the, the, the power to, do the, to arrest anybody you feel that has gone wrong. And after that, you know, let the, your inv investigation be tight if you are sure of what you are saying. The same thing, like we'll continue to talk about it, show worry now. You have a, a case against him and yet you cannot go to court. You are restricting somebody. It's not done that way. And that's the, that was the same thing they did to this uh, man. Um, I, I've forgotten that man. The man that, the Dasuki, yes. They just kept him for close to how many years until when... God has to release him because of a, the influence of Shuwore. If not, the man would have seen you there. And that was exactly what they wanted to do to Shuwore. You have evidence. You said this. You said that. Then tag the person. Let us see. But the only people they will be going after are those who are harmless, those who will criticize them, those who will put it to them that these are the things that you have done that are not okay, that are not right. The next thing, they will begin to invite you. They will begin to uh, tell you it is a, what is it called? It is a, a speech here and there. So I don't just get it. I don't get it. If you know that there are some people who are capable of uh, something, you go after them. You are the chief security officer of the DC. We have security people. Let them do their investigation and bring these people to book and let them confess and give them, you know, that is the problem we are having in this country. They will, they will, they will arrest you first before they start doing investigation. Do your investigation. By the time you put it up to that person, the person will not be able to deny it. But because we are always doing wishy-washy, a, 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 a investigation because you just perceive people, some people as your enemies. Then the next thing is is for you to 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 begin to tag them. If you have good evidence that this is Southern Kaduna leaders are this or that, go after them and you let and prove it to them that what you are saying is the truth. Recently now, these people are beginning to the the House of Fulani now. They are beginning to talk about uh, the 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 uh, state assembly should enact the law for them to have their own chiefdoms. You can imagine. If Elufai will be talking in this manner, how do you expect the people to, to speak? And you say you cannot uh, you can't uh, appeal to them, you can't appeal to them, then what does that tell you as a governor, as somebody who is uh, the leader of all? My own is that anyone who is involved in any form of atrocity, if the government is sincere, let them do the needful. Let them do the needful and and get the people arrested. But because you guys are not sincere, that is why people don't trust you. If it were to be your people who are involved in one thing or the other, something that is not in, in line with what it ought, with, with what ought to be, get them arrested. If it's other people, get them arrested. Then people will now know that you are a neutral person. Now you say you cannot do this. If you know the decent, get them arrested. And know that you are going to frame anybody or be because you don't like their faith. 
or you don't like their face faces or you don't like their gods no that is not what we are talking about because this uh, politics of bitterness is not going to help anybody you can imagine from this statement you know you'll be able to deduce what people are talking about this erufai and that is why you see that the whole thing is going on and on and on and on nobody is debunk, de 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 arresting anybody the people came out and began to to protest that even for the fact that uh, the presence of the security people uh, in that area curfew here and there yet these people who are perpetrating this evil are still there why can't the security people arrest those people if really they are sincere so that is what we are talking about anybody who is involved in any form of a criminality that is causing problems to other people get them arrested what are you waiting for what are you waiting for you don't need to come and tell us you go get them arrested and let them confess let you all see oh these are the people causing the problem you cannot just be making all those say this thing and you they are leaving people lives to be taken away on a daily basis so how do you expect people to be happy now these people are coming to say they want their own chiefdom and they are telling us oh, it was a reprisal but now the so-called safulani they are coming out that uh, the uh, state assembly should enact the law so that they will have their own chiefdom in that particular place so who, 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 who is fooling who even when you talk about reprisal something happened before a reprisal will come uh, uh, come to come to play then why didn't you deal with that situation before you allowing reprisal to have taken place so it is unfortunate really really unfortunate that uh, we have people who do not have the interest of people at that very unfortunate that we have people who are what who are tribalistic and it's showing it's showing it's really really showing when will all these people when will they learn Somebody is asking Erufai here that say, Governor Erufai, what is the latest about the killers of the chief of Adara Kingdom? Let us hear or know the latest as the chief security officer of the state. You are not serious. Try that and it will be it will be the last thing you will do in South in Kaduna State as governor. You make our people blood to be your bathing water. Try it and see. Enough is enough. Is this not an his speech? DSS, where are you now? Okay. Hmm. Erufa, you are right. They are promoting the violence. Uh, arrest of them. One, arrest one of them. I'll be all of them one by one. Like me, I don't even, I don't condone evil. My own is that. I dare you. I dare them. Arrest the people who are involved and let your investigation be right. You cannot just be thinking that oh, some people are the ones behind this whole thing. Just because you don't like them. If they are culpable, let them go in for it. Then those, what of the people who have been, those, whether there's reprisal or there's a, there was an incident that happened in the place, get all of those people arrested and let's do the right thing. Because we have failed to do the right thing, that is why things are not just moving moving on. If it affects us, affects our people, we will not want to do anything. We want to look at the other side. But when it affects other people, yes, oh, you want to be pointing fingers at the people oh, trying to say, oh, these people are the one who are not say uh, who are not right who oh, they have done this they have done that so guys uh, let us hear your opinion concerning what a uh, verify has said that is going to do to southern Cardona leaders